Few things are more sacred to children than their Halloween candy and our pal Jimmy Kimmel with his experiment. For the past three years, I've been challenging parents to pretend they ate all their kids' Halloween candy, shoot video of it, and upload that video to YouTube. But this year, a noticeable difference. More than a thousand videos. And they're striking a chord about the aftermath of Halloween in America. Last night, I ate all your candy. Why? Because it was good. <laughs> you ruined my life! All of it? All of it. Every single bite? Yeah. You must have a bellyache. <laughs> I got hungry last night. Eat an apple. <laughs> Nearly 7 million views in just two days. So many searching for it. While this little boy searches for his candy. Those aren't real drawers, buddy. Get out. But then there were the surprises. Suddenly, the joke on all of us adults. Children this year teaching us a lesson. We ate all the candy. Uh, we'll get some more next time. This has become a Jimmy Kimmel tradition, but I saw something this year I didn't see last year, and, and that little boy who, who pauses and then says, I ate all your candy. <laughs> That's okay. And is that when mom and dad feel a little badly? I think you're probably pretty proud if, if that happens. And who do we have to thank for this experiment? In part, Jimmy's mom. Well, my mother was a real prankster, it still is, and, um, and I, I do the same stuff with my kids. I think, you know, a lot of people say, oh, it's mean, you shouldn't do this. First of all, kids cry 30 times a day, so this is just one of those, those times. And I think most parents know whether their children will be able to handle something like this. His own little Jane, just four months old now. Jane, so last night I ate all your Halloween candy. Jane, not buying it.